What's up, Travis? Just want to reach out, man. Uh, let you know that I'm thinking about you. My family's thinking about you. Um, I hope you're feeling better. I hope you're getting stronger. I uh, I regularly think about our days back with the Lightning, man. I know you always had our back in that back line, man. Uh, we have your back now, man. So if you ever need anything, just let us know. Um, love you, brother. Uh, hopefully, maybe later this year when we get this reunion uh, back to together, uh, we can all get back together and have some fun, have some laughs because uh, we definitely had some back in the day. So I love you, man, um, and be well, all right? See ya. Travis, man, just wanted to let you know I'm sending thoughts and prayers your way. Keep fighting strong. I say to go, boys, never give up. I'll see you soon, brother. Travi, thinking about you, buddy. I hated seeing that text message from Dog about your condition, but I know life is life, and I think you're, you got a good shot owning this thing, beating it, and you and Becky are going to have a long, lovely, family-filled, love-filled life. We can't wait to see you. Just do what you do. Be a stud. Hunker down. Get it done. You're in a great city with great medicine. Um, from my family to yours, we love you. We're pulling for you. I wish I had something funny to say, but fuck, I'm at work. And I'm talking to my boy who's got a tough diagnosis. So no time for humor, just love. And 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 uh, we're thinking about you. Uh, we'll stay close through the team. And certainly if you ever need anything, just reach out, buddy. I'm here. Um, all the best, you, Becky, and the boys. Can't wait to see you this summer. Hey, Travis, what's going on, man? Uh, Jim, let me know that you are going through some treatment and uh, wanted to reach out and send uh, love and prayers. Um, let me know if you guys need anything. Uh, I made it back to Atlanta finally. Um, I'm back here in Decatur. Uh, so if you guys need any help with anything, feel free to give me a call. 678-294-3627. Uh, uh, don't matter what it is, Aaron, whatever. Just give me a buzz, man. Uh, you just need a laugh or a bad joke. I got plenty of those. Uh, let me know, and um, I'll try and help out in any way I can, man. All right. Stay blessed. Take care, man. Travis, been a long time. Jared here. Um, heard about some of the news. Hope you're uh, feeling better, at least a little better. Um, onward and upward from here. Again, much love. Um, going to say a prayer for you this morning and um, yeah I miss you it's been a while so peace T. Larson and I hated to hear the news I heard but figured if I could make you smile at all maybe picture me back in the day just taking the SAT you know working real hard man fight strong buddy talk to you Hey Travis, uh, Ben Landis here. Uh, long time no see. Um, maybe this would remind you <laughs> of me, but um, hey man, I've heard about your health and um, just want to wish you the best. Been thinking about you. I think there's uh, no doubt, man, you're going to defeat this one. Got a lot of victories already in the tank, including that time you guys managed to to squeak out a state championship against against the, the Macintosh Chiefs and you know where we were obviously tougher than cancer so you totally got this one man but no seriously really been thinking about you and look forward to seeing you alright buddy later Travis how you doing buddy so I wrote out a bunch of things to say and then Maddie told us we weren't allowed to make any jokes. So I pretty much had to trash it all. Um, thinking of you, best to you and the family. Tackle this thing. You're going to beat it. Anything you need at all, man, just reach out. Your family, love you, buddy. We'll see you soon at the reunion. Travis, hey, buddy. You've had a hell of a year, man, and a hell of a fight coming up. I want you to know I'm going to be there for you. Not like the time in the state qualifying tournament when you scored 
you came back and I had no idea who scored and you were so let down that I had no idea that you had scored. So not like that time. Um, here for you, like the time in the state high school playoffs when I got knocked out cold and went to the hospital and sometime, you know, came back and you had this crazy look in your eye and you said, hey, Jim, I took care of it. I really don't want to know what that meant, but you were there for me. So I want to be here for you like that, buddy. You're a fighter. You'll get through this. God's got you. I love you, Travis. Hey, Trav. Good afternoon, buddy. Uh, shit, man. I've been thinking about you a lot, and I know you can beat it, man. Don't even sweat that. But I would like to say uh, <clears throat> I have been thinking about you. We got some guardian angels. I just totaled my truck on Thursday and freaking walked away from it. So I'm passing those angels on to you, my man. <clears throat> Love you, brother. Uh, you know, holler at me if you need something. I'm pretty close. I can make it up there in a day. Bring some food or whatnot. Miss you, bud. Let me know how you're doing, and uh, we'll check in on this thing. Not even really sure what it is. Travis, what's going on, brother? It's Jeremy. How you been, man? It's been a minute. I want to make sure I send you out some healing energy. Stay strong during this fight. Fight for more than just yourself. And make sure you appreciate all the little things that we take for granted. Love you, brother. Make sure you stay strong. Keep us posted. Yo, Trav, what's up, man? It's your boy Richards, man. Heard you got dealt a pretty tough hand here lately. Um, I know a lot about tough hands. You remember my car wreck when I was a kid. Uh, there's been other things happened since those days. It's hurdles, we gotta jump in life. God don't give people stuff they can't handle. And I'm gonna tell you right now, when we was kids, he was one of the toughest kids I ever played with, 100%. The best day, one of the best days I had was when I got to play with you and stop playing against you. Um, I know you're a tough guy. I know you'll get through this and you'll put this behind you and you'll look back on it and you know, you'll, you'll win this thing. I know you will. Um, I've, I've dropped, been dropping some prayers for you. My mom and dad dropped some prayers for you. I know you're gonna win this fight and everything's gonna be all right. And I, if you ever want to reach out to me, reach out to me. I'd love to hear from you. You know, if you get some time this summer, um, help come down here to Orange Beach. I got the Tiki boat now. I'll take you for, uh, we can go on a Tiki boat ride and have some beers and catch up, man. Wish you the best of luck, brother. We always love you, man. Get it going, brother. Trav. Hey, buddy. Uh, well, it's Sunday night. And uh, it's actually the third Sunday of the month, so I'm uh, wearing my lightning gold, a uh, little gold medal action. Uh, I'm a little ticked at Amberly though, because I think she must have washed this with the uh, hot water, because it seemed to really shrink up on me here. But hey man, uh, I wanted to send this video to encourage you and just lift you up, man. Um, and since I've known you, every time you've been up against a tough opponent, uh, you've taken the opponent down. And um, I have no doubt you're going to do that with this one. Um, so we're rooting for you. And, um, you know, you've got Becky and the boys supporting you. And um, the whole Lightning 80 Gold family is supporting you, too. We're behind you 100%. And uh, anything you need, brother, you just give me a call. But we love you. Keep fighting, take it day by day. Just know that we're praying for you, we're rooting for you, and you've got this. All right, my man, love you, brother. And at the end of this, we're gonna get you another gold medal that we can wrap around your neck and you'll have two of them. All right, my man, take it easy. See ya. Hey, Travis, it's been a few years. Justin Kohler here. Uh, we just learned about the battle you're going through with cancer. And the first thing I thought about was Travis has this. If he can get through a, a hot Georgia summer, running two a days uh, to win a national championship, then he can definitely crush this cancer. So you're one of the toughest kids I know, so so keep fighting, bud. But in all seriousness, um, we're pulling for you. I'm here from North Carolina, and we know you're gonna beat this. So we can't wait to celebrate. 
um, all of your clean scans down in Athens this summer, that's going to be a good time to celebrate. Let us know if we can do anything for you. Uh, take care and keep fighting, and we're pulling for you, buddy. Hey, man, it's Aaron. I know you've been dealt a tough blow, man, but I know you're a big fighter. Really praying for you guys and your family. Hope to see you guys on better terms soon, man. Uh, anything we can do for you, we're here for you. Love you, man. Good luck. Travis, hey, man. Uh, Steven. Bodie. Say hi, Mr. Travis. Oh, he's giving you a kiss. Oh, man. He must like you. <laughs> Another kiss? Another kiss? Oh, hey, brother. We're, you know, we're rooting for you and uh, thinking about you, praying for you. And uh, we know that if uh, cancer had to deal with anybody, it'd be scared of shit of you and probably Brantley. But, um, yeah, man, we know that you're going to pull out and do great. And, you know, we're excited to see you at the reunion. Bodie's excited and he's really tired. <laughs> and yeah, man, if there's anything we can do or um, if you need anything, he just wants to keep giving you kisses, my man. That's something special. I think there's more kisses than I get. All right. That's, that's, you're making me jealous. Anyways, we love you, man. And, uh, you know, if, if we can do anything, let us know. And, you know, we're excited to see you soon. Keep us posted. And, uh, yeah. Yeah.